This year officially marks 20 years of Unreal Engine on Xbox. Along with unprecedented adoption of Unreal Engine across Microsoft's internal teams, who are building games that the industry will be talking about for the next 5, 10, 15 years. And that leads us to a world-class studio that is very dear to Epic. The Coalition, the team behind the Gears franchise. They have been instrumental in helping the rubber meet the road where it really counts. It is my pleasure to turn it over to Kate Rayner and Colin Penty. We've been working with Unreal Engine 5 for over a year now, and we've already seen a lot of the benefits. Our relationship with Epic uh, has really impacted positively the Gears of War franchise, whether it's collaboration or calls about various systems or contributing code. We've been creating numerous prototypes and demos, and we're happy to show you uh, some of the results today. What you're seeing now is our Alpha Point demo. It was an early access demo that we showed at GDC in 2021. There are a few different components, an abbreviated character cinematic, and a early large world technical test. The open world tech test was built to test a few things. It was built to test the landscape system, how does it react with Nanite, um, how does world partition streaming function, and how do these all come together and perform on Xbox. So MetaHumans came out about halfway through our character rendering visual tech test demo. And so we immediately sort of stopped what we were doing for a bit, took a look at MetaHumans and wanted to see how it could augment our existing character that we were building. And so we pulled things like materials from MetaHumans and eyeballs and teeth and bring it all together and just see what level of fidelity we could hit, throwing all the latest tech in Unreal Engine 5 at it. This cinematic demo brings the character quality of the new rendering systems, the environment technologies, the new Lumen rendering system, all together to create a real-time cinematic experience that goes beyond anything that we've done in the past. I'm personally very proud of them. They were all sort of labors of love for myself and the art team and engineering teams and really opened our eyes towards what the next gen quality visual bar could be. And so it was a huge learning experience for us. And I think it actually set us up really well when Epic came and asked for help on the Matrix Awakens demo. The fact that we were able to ship this experience on Xbox Series S with all the same features, including ray tracing that we had on the Xbox Series X at such a high quality level is really amazing. With the launch of Unreal Engine 5, what I'm most excited for is the developer efficiency that we have for our team. We really are able to deliver a AAA experience that we've always wanted to without the compromises. Unreal Engine 5, I feel like, is a huge game changer, and I feel like we haven't fully even realized how much of a game changer it's going to be. It basically um, democratizes game development across the world, and yes, there's accelerations for AAA developers like ourselves, but it also um, is a great uh, entry point for indie dev studios. And so I think it furthers along Unreal Engine 4's vision of everyone can build a project and, and build a game. And I think it's gonna change the entire industry.